Hey guys, Tom from Fluval here. Today it's all about filter media solutions uh, and how you can address some of the symptoms you may experience in an aquarium from time to time. Chemical filter media in general are the way that you address it with some exceptions of course. We're going to go through some of the typical symptoms you might see and what you can apply and why. Now green water is one of the more common ones. We hear that pretty often. My tank's green. We'll the water itself is green, it's suspended algae. And the way you deal with suspended algae is with a fine filter pad, a polishing pad, like this one for flu from canister for flu canister filters, and you combine its use with something like Fluval Quick Clear, which is a product that's going to increase the efficiency of the pad and help it trap fine particles more easily. The key when using this approach is to, as soon as the water gets clear, throw those pads out where the trapped algae is has accumulated and replace it with a fresh pad, do your partial water change and then address the cause, address the problem. The algae was the symptom, you want to address the problem. So check phosphate levels, nitrate levels. You may have to lower your phosphate. Where is it coming from? You should check your tap water as well along with the tank. And products like Fos um, a Fosclear for example by Fluval are very effective at dropping phosphate. So you may have to use it to reduce that nutrient content in your water. Um, odor is another issue that happens from time to time. It can happen in new, it happens a little bit more frequently in new tanks uh, where the tank is not biologically mature so it might be just a question of doing a few extra water changes, dosing with a product like uh, Fluval Biological Enhancer to help inoculate the tank with nitrifying strains of bacteria and it will eventually resolve itself. Uh, you want to get rid of the odor right away obviously up front you don't want to you don't want to uh, suffer with that well then it's a fresh dose of carbon we have some Fluval Premium Carbon this is very effective at stripping trap gases right out of the water so for immediate uh, removal of the odor a fresh change of carbon and then address what the cause was biological maturity brownish water happens from time to time for example if you're stocking a tank with natural driftwood you're going to want to clear the water again it's a fresh charge of carbon go in there put a fresh dose of carbon it will reduce the discoloration very quickly uh, but in order to have avoided it in the first place usually pre-soaking the driftwood replacing the water daily for a few days in a bucket will help deal with that before you would have had the issue in the first place. In some tanks you might for example have a pH level that's tougher to bring down, the carbonate hardness by, might be a little bit harder, higher and you want to keep fish like Tetris, uh, dwarf uh, South American cichlids that prefer sub neutral levels for pH and, and slightly lower carbonate hardness values. A great product to use is a natural filter media like peat pellets. Uh, peat granules from uh, from Fluval. This is a very effective concentrated peat and it will slowly leach tannins and other acids in the water that will lower pH values and create conditions that are great for those kinds of fish. Ammonia spikes. You might experience a situation where you have a bit of ammonia developing in a tank when you didn't really expect it. Could be a fish that had died and you hadn't noticed it. Uh, that could be one of the causes. Uh, it can also happen as time goes on your biological filter is overwhelmed by the size of your fish, you're feeding heavily, fish are growing, you're happy with your tank, but all of a sudden you've noticed there's some ammonia forming. It could well be because the fish have, are, have kind of surpassed what the capacity of your filter is. Now to deal with the ammonia spike, of course, it's something like um, Fluval Premium Ammonia Remover is very effective change that in your filter it'll drop the ammonia level and then of course manage your tank by perhaps introducing more of a product called Biomax and at the same time of course inoculating that with Fluval Biological Enhancer. Biomax is a very effective biological media and if you increase that in a filter you're inc increasing its capacity to deal with the biological load placed upon it. Now, algae growing on surfaces, on the glass, on the rocks, on the gravel and so forth, does happen from time to time. So you've got to look for the reason as to what might be causing that. Typical filter media solution for that would be something like Fosclear. You would take a phosphate test. If you, if you notice that you're, you're seeing phosphate in your tank that you didn't before, again, you've got to determine where is it coming from. Is it coming from the tap? Is it coming from some new decor I put in my tank, perhaps? Am I feeding a different type of food or more of it? You've got to locate, see what the different issues could be and address them. But in the meantime, to drop and control the phosphate level, you've got phos there. 
So there you have it. You've got a, there's a variety of different symptoms that we've covered that you may see in a tank and address some of the problems that you might want to consider that could have caused those symptoms. So anything else you want to know about filter media solutions or issues you may have, please uh, look us up on fluvalaquatics.com. We hope to hear from you. Thanks a lot for watching the video.